There she is. Woo! There she is. <laughs> Ellie Williams made a great career out of playing beautiful, tough, and really smart women from the practice to lie to me, and now she's back <laughs> starring in Ties That Bind. She plays a Seattle police detective. Did you upload that file for everybody who's working at the restaurant this morning? I did. Name and jacket. All right, let's winnow them down to what we know so far. So based on the angle of impact, Leslie says the killer is at least 5'9". Down to seven. Right-handed? No lefty, still seven. Uh, violent offenders? Oh, down to four. Anger management issues? And the survey says? Oscar. And Jordan. <gasps> Cliffhanger. I know. See, I like Jordan. Be a police detective. You make it look so exciting. I was exciting. trying to be all tough. You get to you play know. one on TV. I you do. always have these great roles. You've been very lucky slash talented. And I should knock. On, I should yeah. knock on some wood. Yes, I've been very fortunate. Do you yeah. like yeah. The, these roles, the tough woman? I do. I love this. This one in particular is different because I play a cop and then you get to see me go home. So it's a sort of ah. hybrid. You know, procedural and family drama at the same time. And I've got Dion Johnstone, who's my partner at work, and I've got. John, Jonathan Scarf, who's my husband, and so you really get to see both of my lives, like yeah. how the job affects home life and vice versa. Well, you mentioned the family drama. Most yeah. of the, the cop hey, shows and the Love procedural you. shows aren't for the, the whole mm -hmm. family. This one's a little different. Yeah, this is the first show that my kids can actually watch with me, at least my <laughs> youngest, my 12-year-old, yeah. and it's kind of exciting to have that. It's really a family drama, you know? So this is Up Network. Yes. This is their real, their, their experiment, their sort of, right? Their scripted series. Ooh, you're like the guinea pig. We are. It's going really well, and they've been lovely. They've given us a lot of freedom, and Cheryl Anderson, who created the show, is just so fantastic. I mean, it's really collaborative. Mm -hmm. Right. So Luke Perry plays your brother, oh, yeah. right? And he goes to jail, yes. and you kind of send him to jail? Yes. Explain. Well, I can't really explain a <laughs> lot, oh, except okay. of course there's a lot of history there. So as the season evolves, you'll find out a little bit about our story. Okay. And uh, hopefully if we get more seasons, then Luke can come back and we can have a lot more drama. I we love Luke. That of good course. fiction. He was great so, to work with. Luke. <laughs> yeah. Yes. Reminds me. So you went to Beverly Hills High. The real one. The yes. real one. Yes. <laughs> so you kind of have something in common. I guess we do. You're a local girl. You grew up here your whole life. Mm -hmm. You've acted since, like you got your SAG card when you were one. Well, that's good research. I, my mom was an actress and I, they needed a baby. And she said, I have a baby and I did a diaper commercial. So <laughs> I got in the union for a diaper no commercial. No way. Yes. And then I didn't join until I was 18. Oh. Okay. Until I graduated so you took high a school. hiatus. Yeah. I believe they I call it. I took some time off. Got yeah. it. So you grew up in <laughs> Bel Air. Yes. And I want to know more about this lemonade, lemonade stand you had because you had the Johnny Carson lemonade. I, I did. Johnny Carson lived across the street from me. <laughs> And the vans would come by, the, the, the tour, the tour yeah. vans. And I finally decided, well, I have lemonade. I have old scripts from Hawaii Five-0 that my mom was on. <laughs> and why not call it Johnny Carson Lemonade? And then he sanctioned it. He came by and he, oh, he had some. It was really pretty cool. Such a little entrepreneur. I had no idea, of course. I was probably Was that like more seven. expensive than the regular one you were selling? I think I hiked it up a little bit. 25 cents or something. 25 cents. It was the 70s. You had such famous neighbors. It was the 70s, <laughs> So, you know, mom was an actress, like mm -hmm. You said. So did you grow up on sets and did, is this something you knew you wanted to do? From the time I was five, I knew I wanted to do it. And my mom was a working actress, so she didn't always work. I had a little more of the realistic view of that you don't always get the job. Yeah. But I was mm -hmm. always her scene partner. Like I'd just go uh, memorize the lines and then go back and help her good work Good training. On it. That was acting school. Yeah. 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 It was great training. Yeah. <laughs> um, so the practice, lie to me, mm -hmm. now this, kind of staying within the same genre. You must enjoy it. Of course, I do. I love it. I like being a working girl. I, I get to go to Vancouver and work, and my kids come and visit me and my husband, and we had a great time. We worked really hard, and we did 10 episodes, so please tune in. How good are you at knowing when people are lying to you? So how bad were the Very good. Really? She's got three <laughs> kids, so well, yes, but I also, like teenagers. You know, we have micro, we have little tells. We have little shoulder shrugs. We look away. We look at each other. That show kind of messed a lot of us up because the entire you, crew oh, would start watching yeah. each other. Like, why'd you just do that? I just saw that. And then all of a sudden, it's like, the it could be about something else. So are you paranoid now? No. <laughs> you're like, you're like no. no. Why is that? Active. That person no. is not making eye contact. They're lying to me. No. You're the expert now. And Army Wives, too. What a great show to be able to get involved in. That was a great show. Yeah. I was there for two years. Um, really great group of people. I mean, that has like, such an amazing following. And mm -hmm. I know. I yeah. know. It was sad to see that one go. Yeah. But I guess, it, you know, it was time. Yeah. You picked the good ones. 
So good luck with this one. Thank you. So nice to meet you. Nice to meet you. Come too. back again. Hi, that bind is on Wednesday, nine o'clock on Up. Gotta check that out. Mm -hmm.